Aha, bonjour, ginawa, minawa. Welcome to Ojibwe Language Table with West Jordan. We are on lesson two, do day mug. Do day mug. And we're talking about our clans along with our self introduction from lesson one. So just to start off our self introduction, Bonjour Akinawea. West Jordan and Dishnikaz, Gidiga Benese and Digo, Makwa and Dudem, Misqua Gamiwe, Zagai Gunning and Dunjaba, Ga Asanitakog and Okay, so that's our self introduction. Lesson two, we, we're going to deal with Dudemug, our clans. As you can see on top, we have Dudemug. Coming from the word do dame, which means our clan. Our clan. And I broke it down. And we add ug to make it plural, so clans. And broke it down do de mug. Okay, so getting started here, we're going to talk about the seven primary clans of Red Lake along with others. And when we say along with others, um in the in the Red Lake Nation flag depicted here, uh, drawn by none other than Johnson Loud Jr., a Red Lake member. Uh, he took seven of the primary clans that were here in Red Lake and uh, put them onto uh, our flag here. And we're going to go through our clans here from left to right. As you can see, if you have a flag in your house or if you see one in town, we're going to know what animals those are and what, what they represent on our flag. So getting started, we have our first one far to the left, Makwa. 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 That's our black bear. Mikinak. Mikinak. And Mikinok is our snapping turtle. Awazese. Awazese. That's our bullhead. Wabajeshe. Wabajeshe. Wabajeshi is a martin, pine martin. Megize. Megize. And Megize is our eagle. Negig. Negig. Nagig is our otter. And our seventh one, the one farthest on the right on our Red Lake Nation flag, Okishke Manise. Okishke Manise. Okishke Manise is our kingfisher. And uh, Okishke Manise was one of our adopted clans here in Red Lake. Adopted from a young Dakota boy. Gishkimanisi. So them are our seven clans. Uh, primary clans in Red Lake. Other clans include Maingan. Maingan. Which is the wolf. Name. Name. That is a sturgeon. A dick. A dick. That is a caribou. Mong. Mong. That is a loon. 
And our last one here, there are probably more. A Jijak. A Jijak. And that is our crane. So if I go back here, the Mong and the Crane Clan, a Jijak, where our uh, where our uh, leaders are said to be the the leaders in our Ojibwe communities, the Loon Clan and the uh, the Crane Clan. So that's just some of the uh, clans that were that are uh, represented here in Red Lake. I'm sure there's more. And um, just keep that in mind that there's more than just the seven. And there's more than just the extra few that I've shown in this slide. So lesson two, we're working on how to say is my clan. Uh, lesson one, we went through um, our name and blank indigenous cause. And the next step in, in to introducing yourself is how to say Blank is my clan. So we're going to get right along there. How to say is my clan. Broke it down syllables on top. In. Do. Dame. So we'll go through our list of all the animals we just went through. Makwa and do a dame. My clan is bear. Or bear is my clan. However you want to say that. Or however it's. It's um. Put out either way is fine in Dude Makwa. A speaker is gonna know what you're saying. Okay, make a knock in Dude. My clan is turtle, or turtle is my clan. A wazasi in Dude. My clan is bullhead, or bullhead is my clan. Wabajeshi in Dude. My clan is Martin. Or Martin is my clan. Megizi and Dudem. My e clan is Eagle. Or Eagle is my clan. Negig and Dudem. My clan is Otter. Or Otter is my clan. Ogishke Manesi and Dudem. My clan is Kingfisher. Or Kingfisher is my clan. So those are the seven that we talked about on the flag. Additional clans. Here in Red Lake, my Ingun in Dudem. Uh, my clan is Wolf, or Wolf is my clan. Name in Dudem. My clan is Sturgeon, or Sturgeon is my clan. A Dick in Dudem. My clan is Caribou, or Caribou is my clan. Mong in Dudem. My clan is Loon, or Loon is my clan. Ajijak in Dudem. My clan is Crane, or Crane is my clan. So again, these are some of the uh, clans that were represented in the, in the, here in Red Lake. Um, your reservation might uh, have different clans than here. Uh, you... If you're not Ojibwe, you might have uh, different clan, uh, not a clan system, but a different system that you uh, follow as far as your, your families go. Uh, review from lesson one. Okay, so like I said before, blank indigenous cause. Blank is my name. Example, Joe indigenous cause. It means Joe is my name or my name is Joe. So we're learning self-introduction. Okay, blank indigo. Blank is what the spirits know me as. Example, misko magizi indigo. Red eagle is what the spirits know me as. Okay, and our third part of this is uh, in blank indu day. Blank is my clan. Example, Makwa in Dude. My clan is Bear or Bear is my clan. And that's what we're working on lesson two. Lesson three, we're going to uh, work on in Dunjaba. So, Blank in Dunjaba. Blank is where I am from. Example, Misqua Gummiwe Zagai Gunning in Dunjaba. 
I am from Red Lake, or Red Lake is where I'm from. And in that lesson three, we're going to go through uh, different reservations throughout Minnesota, how to say them. And um, we'll include all those in lesson three. So I think our last one here, we have blank in da. Blank is where I live or dwell. Example, ga asinizakag in da. Little Rock is where I live or I dwell. So that's just a little review from lesson one. Going through our name, our spirit name, our clan, where we're from, and where we live. All right. All right. So I just wanted to leave, end this session with um, a Ojibwe clan system reference chart that I found online. Um, I don't know who the main source is of this, but uh, it's a good good uh, little reference guide to uh, um, get to little, know a little bit more about what our clans do and um, kind of some of their colors and um, their roles they play in our communities. So uh, real quick, I'll just scan through this. Loon, our Hmong, you know, these are our... The, that clan can include, you know, the ducks, the geese, other birds that swim, it says here. Um, not too sure about these colors. And as you can see, it they are leaders in their communities. Along with Ajijak, our crane, uh, seagulls, pelicans, and all of their shorebirds, for that matter. Um, bald eagle, you know, Benashi, our bird birds eagles hawks owls falcons other birds that fly um quality it says spiritualists agriculturalists and learners again these colors may vary in your community and these roles uh, are pretty much still the same i don't know the colors may vary though so martin here we have the minks uh weasels otters lynx bobcats wolves fox and it says here they were warriors, the hunters, and the providers in their communities. Hoof or deer, such as um, a dick, you know, caribou, moose, elk, caribou again on there, antelope, buffalo, bighorn sheep, goats, their colors, and in their communities they were the listeners and problem solvers. A couple left here, maqua or bear, um, Brown bear, black bear, grizzly bear, polar bears. Just their colors. They're medicine people and peace officers, meaning they're the ones who uh, protect their communities. Is uh, one of the teachings that I was taught. You know, the Makwa, Makwa clan, Du Dame, Makwa Du Dame was the, uh, the enforcers, the uh, protectors of their communities. And our last one down here in the Mickey Knock turtle it says chief this can include um fish and reptiles things that swim in the water oh and there's their colors intellectuals philosophers mediators so i just wanted to share that ojibwe clan system reference chart again i don't know who came up with this but it has some good information on there so i wanted to include that at the end of my uh, powerpoint presentation here all right, miigwech bizin dawiyek minawa, miigwech gi ganawaban de meg. Thank yous for listening and thank yous for watching. Gigawaba min and nim nagach. See yous later. I will see yous later. Ahau.